Let's take a look at what the spider looks like after digestion. The spider's been inside of this trap now for about three or four weeks. Here you can see the legs are sticking out, so this would be what we consider not a clean catch, and you can see how it kind of started to make that little dead spot on the leaf. That was because the inside of the spider started to rot because the plant wasn't able to make a clean seal. When it fails to make a clean seal, digestive enzymes will leak out of the plant and burn the outside as you see there, and it also allows air inside which will rot the corpse of the spider. I attempted to cut the back of the leaf where all the spring tension was, but I didn't cut high enough fortunately, which you'll see here in a second. We're going to go ahead and open this up with some tweezers. You can see the mold that started to grow on the spider there, and that was because the antifungal and antibacterial properties of the digestive enzymes weren't able to fully encompass the spider, which allowed air to mix in there, and that's what started that rot. The plant still got plenty of nutrients from the spider. As you can see, it's probably only about half the size it was, and that's what's left over.